show. All right, this is the Blaring Out with Eric Blair show. We're here at the NAM with Ricky Rocket of Poison. How you doing, Ricky? I'm fantastic. How are you doing? I'm doing great. It's been up with you. I've been uh, trying to recoup from the Poison tour. It's a full year, you know, the between the tour and making the record and everything. And I got a call yesterday, and Bobby said, "Hey, we're going back out this summer." So now we'll go back out again. There is rumors that you're going to do one more album and then call it quits. Is this true? No. What, what we're going to do is we're going to take a summer off. Okay. And we're kind of we're kind of done with it. You know, we're going to finish with the. How can I say it? There's been a lot of retrospective stuff with Poison, and that's fantastic, and it's great. But we're going to take a year off, reassess, make a record, come back out. And we're done with all that. We need to be. We need to move forward. The new, you know, with new stuff, yeah. with the, just a whole new vibe. And um, so I'm looking forward to it. You know, we'll probably do a box set. We'll probably do that kind of stuff. It's not like we're not going to play anything. We, you know, so, uh, our old songs. But it's really time to move forward now. Now, have you guys uh, played with the idea of having any uh, outside songwriters come in? We've played with it. We haven't done it yet. You know. Um, I'm not against any good song. Because that really worked for Aerosmith. Yeah, no, it did. It did. And, and you know, we all still respect Aerosmith, so Absolutely. we would still respect you guys. And you know what? When people are listening to it, they don't care where the song exactly. came from. That's why, you know, I did a solo record. I did a bunch of hits from the 70s that inspired me. I've been getting great response. People just care that they're good songs. Now, I didn't know. You yeah. have a solo album out right now? Yeah, it just came out. Tell me about it. Uh, it's called Glitter for Your Soul. Okay. So all the songs, I not all the songs, but... A bunch of songs that uh, I grew up listening to. And you're singing. As a matter of fact, I think I might have. I sang on one song. I can show the record. Um, I'll show you. Let, let me. This awesome. is what it looks like. Awesome. And you sing on it? I sing on one song. I play drums on everything. I play bass on a song. I play guitar on a song. Produced it. You know, it was just a project I did just for the fun of it. It came out good. So who, did, who, who guests on the album? Uh, I got John Karabi, who's with Molly Crew. Brett and CC both did a track. Gina Shock from the Go Go's, who's here. Awesome. Um, Jizzy Pearl. Right on. That guy's uh, got an awesome voice. Ridiculous. He did an Angel song. We really made him stretch on it. Really? You know? So uh, yeah, some good stuff, man. It came out good. Where would you like to see Poison like after this next record? Would you, you? You know, Aerosmith was a perfect band to say. I I'd love to be an Aerosmith. I mean, I listen to Aerosmith and I go, how can I ever contribute to music again? You know, because I think they're fantastic. But, you know, I think Poison has had a big social impact on music as well as just hits. I think we've meant something. We kind of helped define our era. And it's a shame to, we can't just let it go. Yeah. We have more stories to tell. We're still a viable act. We should get better with age. This is an art form, not modeling. So let's go. You know, you know? what? I don't know if you ever watch VH1 Classics. But your band has the honor of being on there and also being in heavy rotation because the day does not go by when I don't see a Poison video on there. They're very behind us. They've been they've been awesome. And that's good. Yeah. Now I want to take you back. It a helps bit. that I'm dating the guy's daughter, but no, I'm kidding. I, no. No, they've been. No, uh, you wouldn't lower yourself really to that. <laughs> now, um, no, they've been great. Would you be against doing a tour with Striper? I'm not against touring with anybody, really, you know. Yeah, I know um, you guys are pretty open-minded. You know, yeah, definitely. I mean, yeah. they, we opened for them back yeah. in the day. I was just going to mention know? that. I was with Striper the first time you guys ever landed on a stage in L.A. It was at the, um, in Reseda at the Country Club, and I met you, and Vicki Hamilton discovered you yeah, that I night. I saw Vicki Hamilton uh, a month ago. I, I haven't seen her in three years or more, but Striper... Just as long as they do the outfits, I'm in. Really? Oh, you got to do it. They had the best outfits in rock. You guys are known for glam, so what would you say your makeup must-haves are? Well, what I do is I just do this illusion now where if I stand back and get the sizing right, it looks like my face, see? And that that's my must-have now. It's just a prop. So you're not into... Because I'm, I, I'm, you know, I'm a shell of a man. You're over the makeup. I mean, you guys don't wear makeup because... No, I'm not over the makeup. Are you kidding me? Now, we'll I, in fact, I just applied for, uh, I got the, lo the loan came through on my uh, my operation, you know, the change. Wow. I'm, I'm mid-transformation now. Uh, I just have a flap down here. I want to be Hedwig. No, it's, seriously, <laughs> seriously. No, of course we'll do we'll do makeup. Now, yeah. I mean, look, the dynamics changed. Uh, um, but, I mean, we're a visual band. Whatever we're feeling is what we'll do, you know. I mean, you can get contrived. As you get older, oh, a young girl, wear a lot of makeup right. and look good. And then when they're older, I don't want to look like a whore. 
Or do I? Uh, we'll figure that out later. I'm a decent gentleman now. I yeah, have a you're, girlfriend. She you're, ran off on me. Well, Ricky, it's been great talking Thank to you. Thank you very much. Much success in your career. Blaring out with Eric Blair Show yes. with Ricky Rocket. Sign her off. <laughs> Show.